It's no news that the AI job market is hot right now. But most candidates that I talk to just don't know where to begin. That's why I created this video sharing my five-step AI skills roadmap. This exact roadmap has transformed hundreds of my students, even complete beginners with zero coding experience into AI professionals. Let's get started. Step one, the first month is all about building your foundation. And look, I am not gonna sugarcoat this. You need to put in the work here. You really have to pick a language, a programming language that works for you. I say Python is still king and there is a reason why. Python has all these incredible libraries that literally do the heavy lifting for you. TensorFlow, PyTorch, Scikit-learn, they make building AI so much easier. Plus, the syntax is super clean. The craziest part, I just analyzed over 500 AI job listings last month and guess what? 83% explicitly require Python. Not preferred, required. So yeah, this isn't optional, go do this. Where can you get started with Python? Well, some of my favorite courses are DataCamp and Code Academy. They offer the best interactive courses for beginners. Now, the second part is math. Now, I know math freaks a lot of people out. I was really good at it, so really not bragging, but I actually love math. But here's the secret. You really don't need all the math, just specific parts. So let me break it down for you. Linear algebra, it's just about manipulating data in different ways, right? Different dimensions. Statistics, which is about finding patterns in numbers. That's all you need. And guess what? You can really learn these essentials in just two weeks. Khan Academy is one of the best resource here. Their free courses are gold. Now, step two is month two, core AI and machine learning. This is where the fun begins. There is this one course that changed everything for me and for a lot of people, Andrew Wang's machine learning course. This is a course I took years ago when Gen AI was not even a thing. The coolest part about machine learning is really understanding the difference between supervised and unsupervised learning. Think of supervised learning like teaching a kid with flashcards. You know the answers along with the question. Now, unsupervised learning is like letting them discover patterns on their own. Both are super powerful. Deep learning comes next where you will work with neural networks that mimic the human brain. Now, you will learn all this and more in the course that I recommended earlier. Now, step three is your month three and four, where you will pick your specialization. This is where the money is. Trust me, generative AI has absolutely exploded since 2023, and now it's everywhere. The crazy part is there's still a massive skills gap. Companies are desperate for people who understand it. Now, here's where most beginners go wrong with Gen AI. They just play along with ChatGPT without actually understanding how to use it in professional world. Now, there is a massive difference between casual use and building production systems with it. So where do you start? Well, first, DeepLearning.ai's Generative AI with Large Language Models course is one of my favorite courses to understand and break down how these models actually work. So start there. Then, DataCamp's Building AI Applications with OpenAI API. This course teaches you how to actually implement this stuff. You will learn prompt engineering, fine tuning, and how to build retrieval augmented generation systems that make AI outputs factual and reliable. And from there, you can also specialize in computer vision or NLP, video, etc. if that's your jam. Now, step four is month five and six, deployment and production. This is the secret sauce that nobody talks about. Now, let me let you in on a little industry secret. Companies don't just need people who can build AI models. They need people who can 
actually get them working in the real world in production. ML ops, AI ops, LLM ops, all same things. Knowing how to deploy AI in the cloud isn't just a nice to have skill, it's a make or break skill. For this, you need to dive into the cloud AI world. And for cloud AI skills, you need to master three key areas. First, containerization with Docker. It's how you package up your AI so it works anywhere. Second is your orchestration with Kubernetes. Sounds intimidating, but it's just about scaling your AI when traffic spikes. And third is CICD pipelines, which is basically making sure your AI apps can be deployed with ease and fast and you can maintain them. AWS has Bedrock or SageMaker, Google has got Vortex AI platform, and Microsoft has got their Azure AI Foundry. Now, depending on which cloud platform you have easy access to or familiarity with, pick one and start. If you don't know which one to begin with, they all have free tiers. Just pick one. Here's the hack. Start with the free tier of any cloud provider and then deploy a simple sentiment analysis or image analysis model. Follow their tutorials step by step. You will struggle, you will get frustrated, but when it finally works, that feeling is incredible. And boom, you've got your first portfolio project. I do recommend following a certification path for AWS, grab their machine learning specialty cert. Google's professional ML engineer is my favorite one because you actually build real stuff in their hands-on labs. Plus their Coursera specialization totally prepared me for it. Now, Microsoft's AI 102 path is super beginner friendly. I learned Azure completely free using their structured modules that start with AI fundamentals. Now, step five is the portfolio. Let's talk about the portfolio. This is make or break people. Don't just follow tutorials, build some hands-on projects. That's what hiring managers are looking for. So here's where to start. Pick an industry that you are interested in, healthcare, finance, entertainment, whatever is your jam, right? And solve a specific problem in that space. For example, build a tool that uses AI to analyze restaurant reviews and generate improvement suggestions for owners. Now here are three portfolio project ideas for you. First is a Gen AI powered content creation tool with a clean web interface. Your second idea could be custom recommendation system for a niche market, not just another Netflix clone maybe. Third could be your real world computer vision project that solves an everyday problem. Another hidden gem that I really like is an AI engineering community on Discord. They have these weekly project challenges and give you feedback from actual senior engineers. Amazing resource. And also take advantage of Kaggle, but not for the competitions that everyone talks about. Instead, go to their data set section, find something interesting there and build a unique solution around that data. That's what shows you can t think independently. Your portfolio doesn't need to be fancy. GitHub plus a simple documentation would totally do it. But this is crucial. You must include a video demo. Nobody has time to clone and run your code. My two minute demos have gotten more attention than any other part of my portfolio. Also, write a killer readme that explains the problem that you're solving, why it matters, and your approach, the challenges that you faced, and what you've learned. This shows your thinking process, which is what your senior engineers and hiring managers are really looking for. And here's my secret weapon. Build something that you can actually show to non-technical people too. Now my mom has no idea what TensorFlow is, but when I showed her my app that could identify plants from photos, she got it immediately. That kind of project makes you memorable in interviews. For more ideas on what you can build, I love this AI collection GitHub repo, which features a collection of awesome Gen AI applications. Get some inspiration from here. Check it out for everything from education to legal to music sales and so much more. So to recap, the five essential skills are Python programming, just enough math, machine learning fundamentals, 
one specialized AI skill and deployment know-how. Master these in six months or so and you're set. I've created this insane roadmap PDF with every resource that I've mentioned. That's it. If this helped you, smash that like button, hit subscribe and drop a comment with your biggest AI learning challenge and the links that I may have missed. I read and respond to every single comment. Thanks for hanging out and I will catch you in the next video.